February 19, 2013 to July 8, 2013. During this time period, Saturn is in the sign of Libra but is now moving backward in retrograde. He's still in the Nakshatra constellation of Swati, which is ruled by planet Rahu. Saturn and Rahu are similar in how they deliver results. Typically, Saturn follows a forward planetary motion, while Rahu follows a backward one. Now, both Saturn and Rahu are in retrograde motion. Indications are present for possible disbursements of insurance benefits. Students will be active and will do well in their studies during this period. You will have courage to face your challenges. New negotiations will be successful. Marriage proposals are likely to be made during this time. You may want to delay marriage plans, though, until Saturn transits out of Libra, the eighth house. November 5th, 2013 to March 2nd, 2014. During this time, Saturn is in the sign of Libra, but will move into the Nakshatra constellation of Vishaka which is ruled by planet Jupiter. Jupiter is the ruler of Pisces, the first house, and Sagittarius, the tenth house, in respect to your birth sign. This placement may cause fear and disappointment. You may inherit wealth. Long pending outstanding amounts due to you are likely to be realized during this period. Difficulties are indicated in the profession. Heavy workflow can be expected and there will be less or no job satisfaction. There may be a tendency to resign from the current job. Don't take this course of action as you may regret it at a later stage. There may be troubles related to friends as well. March 3rd, 2014 to July 20th, 2014. During this time period, Saturn is in the sign of Libra, but is now moving backward in retrograde and is still within the Nakshatra constellation of Vishaka, which is ruled by planet Jupiter. Retrograde Saturn in the 8th house will improve your health. You will be in a position to bargain effectively and negotiate. Keep this information private and do not make it public knowledge. Students will perform well in their studies during this period. Your spiritual interests will grow and pilgrimages are advisable during this time. July 21st, 2014 to November 2nd, 2014. During this time period, Saturn is in the sign of Libra, but will move into the Nakshatra constellation of Vishaka, which is ruled by planet Jupiter. Be cautious of all things while Saturn is still transiting Libra, the eighth house. Upon completion of this transit, Saturn moves to Scorpio, the ninth house. Thank you. Hello, Pisces moon. So we just watched your Saturn transit predictions. And now I'd like to give you some remedies that you can do to have protection against some of the negative influences that Saturn may bring during this time. Now there are a couple of fire rituals for you to do. Uh, one is to the planet Saturn. One is to Lakshmi Kubera. And also to perform a fire ritual to the planet Rahu. And there is also good to listen to the chant of Vishnu, the 1,000 names of Vishnu uh, on Saturday. And to chant uh, the planet Saturn's uh, mantra. So that his mantra is Om Shani Shraya Namaha, Om Shani Shraya Namaha, Om Shani Shraya Namaha. Chant that 108 times every Saturday. This will bring in the protection. And there is one other remedy, and that is to perform a puja to um, Saturn on Saturday. And that is simply taking a sesame oil lamp and lighting it. And if you have a yantra or a picture of Saturn, show it to that picture or just in the in the air, just um, offer it to Saturn. This will bring in a tremendous protection for you during this time. There are also some general remedies that you can do. One is to feed a black crow. That is, uh, that is Saturn's vehicle. So feeding black crows brings in his blessing. Feeding homeless people who are in need of, who are hungry and need of uh, um, food that will bring in his blessings as well. And the simple remedy that everyone can do is that is to wear black on Saturday. 